Today we're going to take a look at the Titan Weld On Hydraulic Disc Brake Actuator with the electric lockout and a 2 and 5 16 ball coupler. has a 12,500 pound weight capacity. Now this hydraulic actuator will activate your trailer brakes when your tow vehicle slows or stops. Basically what happens is when you apply the brakes in your tow vehicle, deceleration occurs and the momentum pushes your trailer toward the rear of your vehicle. With a surge brake system, this actuator is triggered as your trailer moves forward once your tow vehicle starts to slow down. And when this happens, this actuator will contract and it applies force to the master cylinder. And this in turn supplies the necessary hydraulic pressure to engage your trailer brakes. Now this one is a unique roller design. Reduces the resistance during the telescoping to create a nice straight line movement. If you notice on the roller itself, it has a grease zerk fitting on the end. Makes for easy lubrication. This is a sturdy, durable steel construction. Resists bending in any jackknife situations. The ball coupler right up at the front here has a nice trigger latch, which allows for safe and easy coupling and uncoupling. Has a nice circle grip that you grab, makes the latch simple to use. Just pull back on the trigger and it opens the ball socket, drops onto your ball. Once you get it onto the ball, just rotate it back into place and that circle grip will lock into place and it locks it onto the ball and you're ready to go. Now this one does include an electric reverse lockout. If you look at the back here on the master cylinder, they have a solenoid and this will let you back up without actuating your trailer brakes. Basically, the electric reverse lockout is automatically activated when you shift your tow vehicle into reverse. It has the two wires on it that you wire into your trailer connector, which connects to your tow vehicle so that it can detect when you're going into reverse. So when you're in reverse, the solenoid ensures that the hydraulic actuator does not activate your trailer brakes, thus allowing you to back up your vehicle. Now, to use this electric lockout feature, you do have to have a five-way flat six-way round or seven-pole trailer connector. If you notice, it does include this nice built-in shield to protect the solenoid valve from the elements and from any damage. The finish on this actuator is a nice corrosion-resistant prime finish. The breakaway kit is included. If you notice this chain right here, it's attached to your breakaway lever. This is what will get attached to your tow vehicle just in case your trailer comes detached from your tow vehicle. It would pull this chain, which would activate the brakes to stop a runaway situation. Now this actuator is a weld-on installation. It's designed to mount on a straight 3-inch wide trailer tongue. A few specs on this, the applications for trailers with disc brakes. The ball size that this fits on is a 2 and 5 16 diameter. Gross towing weight capacity again is 12,500 pounds and the maximum tongue weight capacity is 1,250 pounds. But that should do it for the review on the Titan Weld-on Hydraulic Disc Brake Actuator with the electric lockout and a 2 and 5 16 ball coupler and a 12,500 pound weight capacity.